Hey, hey, hey! Happy Saturday, friends! Welcome to another round of Game Played, and I guess Happy New Year! I don't think we've had a Game Played since we started this 2021 season, so hello and welcome back! Thank you for being here. I'm your uh, host, Jake Michaels, and we'll be playing a little bit of Quantitative Easing today, which is uh, a combination silly game and serious game, because we are trying to recover from a financial crisis with printing money <laughs> it is a strange game that i am very much intrigued by in fact one of our guests today introduced it to me well before the pandemic started and i was so eager to play it again we waited a full year before trying but uh we are finally here reunited today and i'm excited to have everybody on and uh introduce our guests so i'm just gonna kick right into it our first gentleman is the person who uh introduced me to this game and one of my uh great friends in board gaming please welcome ruel gaviola Hello, friends. How's it going, Jake? Good. How are you, buddy? Okay, and Happy New Year to you and Happy everyone New out Year. there. So excited to play this game today. Man, when we played this together in the Dragon Moon Meeple, which yes. was a game store that was open in Los Angeles near USC, uh, this game blew my mind. It's It has that effect on people because it's that whole, wait, what? I can bid anything I want? Like, there's no limit and. Yeah, it's so crazy. Unlimited money, and then you get punished for spending too much. That's right. You you bankrupt your your country, um, which you don't <laughs> want to do <laughs> in any case. Yes, that's good advice. Do right. not bankrupt your country. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I like that motto. Yeah. Uh, you've been doing well, Ruel? I have. I've been hanging in there, you know, despite everything that's going on in our country these days. Uh, hanging in there. I'm all These days, Jake, I'm all about self-care, you good. know, so... You know, I'm reading comic books. I am watching movies and I'm eating things that I normally probably wouldn't eat. But that's, <laughs> that's, that's how you do it. <laughs> now, are you familiar with board games? Uh, a little bit. I've heard they're a thing. They're fun to play, apparently. Mm -hmm. yeah. What if there was just a bunch of empty boxes that you got as like set dressing? That, that would be funny. That, that would be great. There's just there's a bunch of pizzas in these boxes. That's that's all that is. <laughs> Before I move on, I have to say you have the Istanbul expansions back there, don't you? Yes, I just picked these up this morning too. I'm Dude, so excited. Getting they're so good. That coffee oh. and uh, the mail one as well. Yes. Couriers or something like that. Couriers. Mm, yeah, they make the game so good. We'll have to play that sometime. Absolutely, my friend. Absolutely. Okay, well, you and I could talk about games forever, but we should introduce that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, true. Uh, this is his first time on uh, Good Times Society, and I'm so excited to welcome him. Please uh, uh, please welcome Lord of the Board, also known as Sam Smith. What is up? How are you what guys doing? Up? Sam. Dude, what's up, Ruel? Good to see you, man. <laughs> How you been? All right. Happy New Year, you. Sam. Oh, thank Welcome you. Happy New Year to you guys. Thank you so much. Uh, I, I, we've never really hung out, Sam, so I'm excited to actually play a game with you, which is a good way to introduce ourselves to each other. I think that this is the perfect game to play when we don't know each other at all. That's so true. <laughs> yeah, because it's hidden bidding, and so we don't know how to trust each other. In fact, we played like a practice round before this show started, and Sam threw us all for a loop, and it was wonderfully great. And now I, I know a little bit more about Sam. <laughs> 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 but I don't know how to read Sam. It's perfect. It's perfect. I have an edge, finally. <laughs> yeah, finally, finally. <laughs> uh, and let's bring our last guest in here. Uh, she's really wonderful. You can catch her uh, awesome game work with uh, her and her has been on before you play it's monique mo no i was gonna pronounce it right <laughs> yes yes. It. yes hi how are you hi, all monique. doing happy holidays hi, monique. hi. this is happy exciting holidays. <laughs> yeah i'm excited to have you here i've never played a game with you either so i'm so, yeah. I'm so glad we get a new new friends in the new year yes very exciting. I'm nervous. Nervous about nervous. Oh, why are you nervous? Too much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. So it's a game that like it's you are in the dark for so long. You don't really know how you're doing, right? Yeah. And I I love that problem. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And now yeah. I know that Sam is kind of uh, the person to look out for here. Yeah. <laughs> what? We're building this no reputation more? for Sam for being the wild card in the group already. Oh, my God. <laughs> wild. Well, he's, he's good at games, so you got to be careful. Anyone that's good at games. And speaking of good at games, we need to keep our eye on our host, friends. I've played yeah. many a game with Mr. Michaels, and I, I we like to call him uh, the, the one with the silver tongue. So be careful. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. First impressions, I don't trust him one bit. <laughs> I think it's become part of your gaming, like, 
process Ruel at the beginning of the game after like everybody's gone to the bathroom, gotten their water, explained the rules, warning about Jake. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Every single game we play, this is this is this it my, is my process totally. <laughs> <laughs> there's always a campaign against me coming from Ruel and generally from other players as well, but like it always has to be laid at the outset for sure. <laughs> well, let's let's That's get into this crazy game. I'm gonna show everybody my screen, which is gonna be a little secretive for you three, but uh we'll we'll show everybody what's going on here. So uh this is called quantitative easing. Uh, we are playing it on Tabletop Simulator because that's the digital version of getting it. This is actually made by BoardGameTables.com. And uh, you can actually pick it up. I'll put a link in the description of this video. Uh, it is actually back on sale. It was a limited Kickstarter for a while, but now they actually have it available. And it's a super fun game. Uh, to explain it, for those of you that have never played, we are playing countries. Uh, I am Japan. Ruel is China. Um, Monique is, are you the European Union? I yeah, am. European Union. And then uh, Sam is good old fashioned USA. What's Ooh. gonna happen is there are 16 company tiles. These are businesses that have gone out of business due to the 2007, 2008 financial crash. <laughs> it's, it's so weird to describe a historical event that feels like it was just a few years ago, but yeah. I guess it was <laughs> yeah. Years ago. Uh, anyway, as part, of, as part of the economic recovery, uh, all, all these uh, countries went through a process called quantitative easing where they pretty much, oh man, I don't even know how to explain this because I am not an economics professor, but they pretty much uh, bought back money and treasury bonds from banks to liquidate them and give them more cash to then purchase businesses or like augment businesses or feed them money. Uh, if you, if I am wrong on that, please feel free to let me know. And I'm totally fine being wrong on that, but it's roughly the same thing. Whereas <laughs> they gave a bunch of money to companies to help them uh, recover from the recession and from the uh, economic depression. Right. But uh, the problem is with this game is that you, we're going to be bidding money to get these tiles. However, at the uh, the tiles are worth points. Like I'm gonna flip one right now. Like this one is worth two points. Uh, it is a Japanese company that is a manufacturing company. And in addition to the two points, it also is worth a combination of points based on how you uh, combo up either monopolization or diversification by getting different companies in different industries. We'll go through the the scoring of that in a second. But what happens is is we bid blindly with these tiles right here, and we can bid any amount of money. Any amount, Jake? There yeah. is no limit, Ruel. No Anything? limit. And uh, <laughs> someone is echoing, just so you know, if someone has a loudspeaker in there. We might need to turn that down a little bit, just a tad. Um, we could bid any amount of money, and whoever bids the most wins the tile. But at the end of the game, whoever has bid cumulatively the, <laughs> cumulatively the most automatically loses. So you need to not bid the most, but still gain the most company tile points to win the game. Um, the bonus tiles, or the, excuse me, the bonus points that come from acquiring tiles include the, the money you get from the tile itself. That's known as the company VP. Uh, anytime you bid $0, you also get a couple of points. Uh, anytime you get um, companies that come from your country, you get points. So for on my uh, scorecard here, it says JP companies. That stands for Japanese companies. Uh, I will get a certain amount of points, which is located in the laurels above that for every one that I do. And then monopolization. So if you get uh, multiple tiles from one industry, you can get a lot of points. Additionally, diversification is if you can get up to three or four of each type, you get uh, bonus points. And then finally, if you are the person to spend the least amount of money on your bids, you also get an additional six points. We total those points. The highest person, uh, the person with the highest points, I should say, will win the game, provided they aren't also the person who spent the most to get them. And that's essentially QE. Is there anything crucial I'm forgetting, friends? I think that's it. I, I was just yeah. thinking about how you explain quantitative easing, Jake. It might be easier if you put up some pie charts. And <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee you it will not be easier if I start with pie charts. Because I'm just going to be pointing to colors and I don't know what they mean. <laughs> 
Um, so yeah, okay. Well, that's quantitative easing. So I think we can actually just really kick right into it because uh, there's not really much else to explain. So I'm going to put this tile back because that's not going to be the first one we do. We're going <laughs> to shuffle these up real quick. And we have chosen the first auctioneer. Every time uh, a round, be or excuse me, a turn begins, one person is the auctioneer and their bid is public knowledge. So they're going to set the bidding at one number. We all each privately get to bid presumably higher on that number, although not necessarily. Uh, then we secretly uh, give the bids to the auctioneer who looks at them all without telling us what they are and then announces who the winner is. The benefit to the auctioneer is they get to see all of the bids and know them, so they get that information. So we all get a chance to be the auctioneer uh, every round, and there are four rounds. Ruel is the first auctioneer because he was the last person that went to a bank, as according to the rules in the rule book. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how was your experience at the bank, Ruel? Was it a it, deposit or a withdrawal? It was a withdrawal, unfortunately. Um, I went to the bank this morning, uh, had my mask, went to the ATM, and I think I washed my hands for 20 minutes right afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it unfortunate? You got money. I, I did, but it's from my account. I'd rather just receive money out of the air. <laughs> Perfect. Has that happened before? <laughs> uh, no, but you know, I can always hope. I can yeah. I have dream dream. I have dream. Okay, yeah, sure. Uh okay, cool. So Ruel, why don't you reveal the first company tile and okay. then we can start bidding on it? Do cool. we have our starting industry tile? Oh, thank you. Oh, that's right. I knew I was forgetting something. Thank you so much, Monique. Yeah. Uh, additionally, there are four industry tiles which represent the four industries we're going to be bidding on today. Agriculture, housing, finance, and manufacturing. Did you take one, Sam? Perfect. Okay, everybody can take one. Um, and keep it secret um, because you know what yours is. So uh, it should match an icon that's of one of these three. Government is not in the game. That's for when you play a five-player game. So it's agriculture, housing, finance, and manufacturing. Um, so that'll go to scoring bonuses for our points in the end game. So that your whatever one you have, you have a little bit of a bonus extra for monopolization and for diversification. All right. Okay. Let's do it. I'm so ready. All right, we all ready. Oh. So let's flip over this first uh, <laughs> tile. We've got China, three points, and it is housing. Ooh. All right. A Chinese company, a housing company. And Ruel will start the bidding. So this is worth a little bit more to Ruel because he is China. And so he would get bonus points uh, if he acquired it. That's there are right. four Chinese companies in the game. Okay. There's four of each company's tile in the game, actually, I should say. Or country, not company. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Okay, so I'm going to bid um, just to make this a little And while Ruel's doing this, while you're wondering, we have these large boxes here. These uh, They're not opaque on, on our screen, obviously. But when, when a player pulls their bidding tile into that area, other players can't see what's going on. So our bids are private, and then we'll flip them over and then put them on the table for the auctioneer to, to see. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Here All we right. go, friends. Oh, oh my gosh, it begins. <laughs> that is a very exact number. <laughs> Ruel's job is to uh he has to provide a positive number that is a whole number and he's chosen 23,456 uh, uh we'll just say dollars just to yeah. keep it in the <laughs> currency. So now our job is to bid a different amount, uh, presumably higher, but not necessarily. And um, when you bid that amount, uh, we're going to put it down secretly for Ruel to see who wins. Um, woof. All right. Oh, I'm already regretting my choice. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I'm already regretting my choice. It's the <clears throat> first round. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> okay. Are we ready? ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> okay. The winning bid is Sam from the U.S. Oh no! Congratulations, okay. Sam. Again. <laughs> so, wow. Sam, you go ahead and write in your little score sheet, right? Well, yeah. You... That means some things. Yeah, and then. As the auctioneer, I reveal anyone that's um, done a zero bid. And you want to talk about the zero bid, Jake? Yeah, I do. You can flip it now and just let oh, us okay, know. Cool. So Jake has done a zero bid. Yes. So uh, you every round, which is any time uh, everyone's been the auctioneer once, you get a chance to do a zero bid where you bid zero dollars, but you will get two victory points in the end game. So there's that, at least. Nice. I can't believe I did that in my first round. I've never done that before. But <laughs> were, were you just talking about how you never do zero bids? <laughs> did, was I? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 
But again, I'm silver tongued, right? So silver tongued friends, I'm <laughs> it's telling two you. Points. It's lies. It's <laughs> already <laughs> starting. It's it, already starting. It has started, yes. Uh Nightcat not a bot asks, the auctioneer can win two if everyone else bids zero for extra points, right? That is true. Also, mm -hmm. the auctioneer can win if no one bids above them, but if you wouldn't really bid lower than the auctioneer unless it was zero. So yeah, that's correct. Yeah. Although you can, if you don't want a tile, you could bid something below that. And if you've already used your zero bid, right? That's true. You can only benefit from a zero bid once per round. So yes, you could bid below that. Yeah. Gotcha. But again, it wouldn't really provide you with anything because you know the auctioneer is going to win. Right. But maybe the auctioneer put up a bid that's way too high and you don't yeah. want to that. So yeah, that happens. Yeah. The thing is, is you don't have to add to your money any bids you don't win. So we actually all have privately have a note card here in our personal area where we're going to keep a tally of all the bids we've made. Because at the end of the game, remember, whoever's bid the most total automatically loses. That's great. <laughs> I love that's that. Sad. Cool. Yeah. I will definitely be there. <laughs> <laughs> I've already, I'm already ready. I've <laughs> mentally prepared. Yep. All right. So is it my turn? It uh, is your turn. Yep. All right, guys. We are bidding for the, oh. My homeland, oh. the U, the U.S. The US. Housing Corporation. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. All right. Let me put my my little bit in here. <clears throat> wow, it's serious. I know it is. It's, like it's not that here. serious, guys. <laughs> 1100. Oh, okay. Oh. Now I got to remember. I mean, I unquestionably I remember what Ruel bid because it's so unique, but like, yeah. Where are we at here? Okay. 20,100. Hmm. I wonder how much Sam bid last time. <laughs> So viewers, you're obviously going to see my version of events because we're not going to be able to see my opponent. So you're, I guess you're on my side uh, or you're rooting against me and uh, you get to see my downfall. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So um, the winner of this bid is Japan with Jake. Ooh. Um, and then we have two zero bids today. <laughs> <laughs> both, both, both of the ah, other contenders zero bid. That's the worst. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay. The bamboozling begins. Oh, oh man, I was bamboozled. Hardcore. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. I was, I was a bit bamboozled myself. Oh, I'm sorry. I just hit undo, y'all. Uh -oh. Sorry about that. Um, I realized I, I deleted my um, amount before I wrote it into my note card, and I actually don't remember off the top of my head, but I'm pretty sure I got it. I remember Is that it right, too. chat? Let me know. Oh, chat will let them. And yes, the bids are written with a dry erase in the physical game. That is true. Yeah, chat. If I if my bid was wrong, let me know. <laughs> like honestly what a wonderful game. game i i want to go out and buy this right after this. right That's right I, I, it's I already really it. love it yeah, i was like i need yeah. to get this and he's like yeah. cover. <laughs> i might retheme it i might retheme the box cover i might just make my own box cover okay oh, okay do it because I, I just don't like to look at that you know <laughs> <laughs> that would be interesting <laughs> um, all right so monique you are yes. the auctioneer now here we go we have a one point in japan what what is that? Is it fin finance? That is a finance company, a right? Finance. The symbol okay. on the bottom uh, denotes which symbol is. Oh, it. I see it. Okay, I see. Yeah, it. the pictures are always unclear. <laughs> uh, hmm. Oh gosh, this is interesting. The starting bid. How do you decide the starting bid? Yeah. So we had two. Don't okay. do anything you'll regret. I know. I'm worried about that. <laughs> All right. So we're going with 15,433. Good luck. Oh. I like that bid, Monique. That you is do. A, that is a good bid. I felt good about it. You know? <laughs> I, I, I like that. <laughs> I, I like it too. I like it too. I'll, uh, I agree. Know, yeah. Much That's respect nice. for that bid. Yeah. Okay. Um, let me take my card back here. Let's just peek. Okay. I like looking at the bids. That part is really exciting. Yeah, right? <laughs> Man, you guys are so quick. Holy cow. 
friends. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm still thinking mine over. Okay. Oh, it's a game too where you think you've either hosed yourself or like really done something awesome in the first round, and then like three rounds later, you could be like, well, everything's gone now. <laughs> well, that was that was not as cool as I thought it would be. I feel All right, like we have our final bids in, and it looks go. like the winner. Let's make sure I got this right. Is the U.S. the U.S. the U.S. is <laughs> racking up some wow some money yeah. over here? Okay, <laughs> racking up a bill, racking, racking up, up some debt for sure. <laughs> I'm just going thematically, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I respect it. All right. Okay. Oh no. Guys, I wasn't supposed to win that one. Come on. <laughs> I love those bids. Like you want to, you don't really want to win it, you know? Yeah. I mean, we're like two people both bid zero and I bid over the auctioneer, but we don't know how much. <laughs> oh man. All right, so that makes me the bidder or the auctioneer, excuse me. Um, so take your tile back, Ruel. I'm gonna flip over this company tile. It is a Chinese agricultural company hmm. with a great tractor symbol all right so uh i will open the bid at uh sixteen thousand five. Sixteen five. 16 huh? yeah interesting oh that is interesting i mean i think any number i put you guys are going to say the game is interesting. Actually, uh, you're wrong. I wasn't going to say interesting if it had been 15,003. Like contemptible. It's the five that really gets me. <laughs> oh my gosh. What am I going to bid here? Okay. I'm not going to overthink it. There it is. <laughs> all right well our winner is china ah. right. additionally the u.s has wisely bid a zero dollars <laughs> oh okay all right so china track your bid take your winning company and you are the next auctioneer which means we enter round two you need to start spending some money now yeah, it's a little it's bit more safe money. To yeah. spend money because some of us have spent <laughs> some money. <laughs> hey, you guys have no idea how much I actually spent. Actually, some of you have some ideas, but that's oh, true. We, we, we all have some ideas. Yeah. Some have perfect information, some have imperfect information. I guess except for me, because I know you bid zero dollars, which doesn't help me whatsoever. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's all right. But I, that's that's what I really like. Uh, what the thing I like about this game, Jake, is it's just you know you it's imperfect information throughout, and you're just trying to piece it all together and you know mm -hmm. figure out how much you should bid at any time. Yeah, totally. totally. Yeah. I feel like when we played the first time, Ruel, it was a surprise who'd bid the most. Like that person who bid it was like, oh no, it was me. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> that's how I felt both of these last <laughs> rounds. <actually>. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, so this next one, which we have drawn, is China. One is manufacturing. Okay. Mm. So I'm going to open the bidding. Um, ooh, okay. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. It's like every, every tile is like, ooh. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. Every, I don't know if I... Oh, I don't want to bid on this now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's do this. Um I'm going to open the bidding at 15,000. No, 12,000. No, 13,000. <laughs> oh, boy. This you is can also bid one. There it is. This is getting to be too much stress. Yes. Wow, okay. that is exact. Once that again, is. once again. Um... I like to be precise in my... Um, Pricing. Okay, Europe, European Union, Japan. Okay. I 
it's funny because we all play so many games too where you can kind of constantly keep track of where you're at because we play a lot of games where scoring is a very active part of at least the turn where you do a thing you score the points yeah right this is like kind of the opposite of that there are plenty of games that don't have scoring but this one is like you don't have scoring you don't even know what your opponent's doing right. <laughs> right? <laughs> it's the ultimate surprise yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay so we have this one what was my bid or what was my opener? Okay. <laughs> this, this, and this. Okay. So Japan has won. Oh, congratulations, Japan. And Europe, uh, so <laughs> Euro US is done. Europe has bid a zero. I did. Oh, oh. I did. Oh, I, I'm going to just bid like one big bid one day. Oh, my God. Yeah. Word. Okay. <laughs> okay. And I'm just going to rephrase. We are only writing down when we win a bid, right? Correct. Yeah. Because that's the money that was spent. Therefore, our yep. debt is just accumulating. Okay. Your debt so is only have... the ones you win, right? All right. All right. I'm just making you absolute. You should only have two numbers. I, I only have two. Yep. yep. I was just making absolute sure. Yeah. You cool. Got... cool. 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 Jake, you have two tiles, correct? I do. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, wait, how are we gonna beat Jake? Uh, all right. Yeah, I have two tiles too. Oh, you? Do? Oh, you? Okay, yeah, I didn't. I'm see just that. showing off. I want. <laughs> I want you to see my stuff. Come on. Okay. All right, uh, Sam, you are now auctioneer. Oh, oh gosh. Let's <clears throat> see what we got here. <clears throat> okay, so we have got. Ha ha. Monique's. That's Europe? right. Is it what? What is it called? European Europe? Union. Yeah. European, European Union. Union? Um, and then it's also a uh, financial company. Mm. It gives three victory points. So this is oof, oof. Mm. pretty good. Pretty good. Just give me a second. <clears throat> so while you're thinking about it, Sam, I'll remind the viewers that monopolization is when you get all four or actually a, a, a multiple of one type of tile. And then diversification is when you get at least three or four uh Unique ones. Matching Thirty thousand. I guess is the better word. Thirty thousand dollars, dear lord. Thirty thousand. Oh my gosh. Oh, no. Times are You're tough. <laughs> 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 wow. I was like, I know she wants it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. Hey, yeah. No uh, more zero uh, bid anymore, Monique. Here's where we get into trouble. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Let's see. Oh, well, I'm man. trying to remember what like the mean money was in our game. Was it around this? It was like I think it was in the tens of thousands then too. I think we eventually got up to like hundreds of thousands. Yeah, we? we probably did. Yeah. But that's the crazy thing about this game. It's any amount, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh <sighs> gosh. I have fear. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've all been really terrified do. of this game that we all enjoy playing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I also have fear, but that's just that's a whole different kind of fear right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh man. Okay. <laughs> oh, y'all are gonna kill me. Okay. <laughs> Bro, what are you doing? I, you man, I, well. Okay. <laughs> there, there I'm, very, I'm nervous. Oh, I'm so interested. What does that mean? I know, I'm nervous. <laughs> All right, so uh, winning bid goes to the European Union. Congratulations. Thank you. I hope um, I didn't win it by much. I, <laughs> um, I will not give you any information. Uh, we've got a zero bid from Yay. Japan. So Jake, oh, okay. zero bidded. That's not a word. <laughs> <laughs> Monique, is that the first tile you've won? It is. Okay. It is. Sadly. Sure think about things here just, <clears throat> just for my curiosity but you guys have wisely bid on those tiles that are worth more points i kept bidding on the one point tiles so uh, <laughs> even though diversification and monopolization might help me hey i got a one point tile too and i'm already disappointed <laughs> <laughs> i think we're all unhappy with our situation <laughs> like, we're also simultaneously jealous of everyone else <laughs> i am pretty i am kind of jealous i am kind of jealous because your one tile is america so you we can swap if you want Oh yeah, yeah. crazy. <laughs> you cannot actually. Remember trading ah. being in the rule. <laughs> Should add that actually. All right, uh, European Union, you are now the auctioneer. Oh yes, okay. So we have it looks like a four point China tile Holy that man. is financial. <laughs> so four points. Friendly reminder and. Oof. 
How much are we going? So to... that's the highest they go. They don't go up to five. They just go up to four, right? They go up to four. It's one through oh, four. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Incons and I'm looking over here at the combination of stuff that people have. Okay. So. Yeah, I'd say this is worth like maybe five bucks. <laughs> <laughs> I would agree. I would agree with that. Thank you, Sam. Money, five bucks. Five bucks. Yeah. I feel like it doesn't really matter what my starting bid is because people are gonna feel like it's worth way more anyway. So we're gonna just go at thirty thousand. So we easy. don't have that kind of cash to throw. That's not five bucks. <laughs> <It is> four, <laughs> four points. It is a four point. Yeah, that's true. Four point tile. Oh my gosh. This is a tricky one, I'll tell you. This that. is really a really very tricky. tricky one. Yeah. I don't I don't like this one at all, actually. This would have been incredibly meta. Yeah. I'm, and... I'm, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> so of course I like it. I just don't like the price I'm about to pay for. I'll be straight up honest. I cannot wait to see yeah. what that is. Oh. Me I too. Think... Because I need more people to be more in debt, you know, because I'm already Yeah. Yeah, you I'm, I'm floating, bro. I, I think I might no. I might throw everyone for a loop here, actually. Let me see if I can do this. Uh, so the this US... guy who put a bunch of gold bars on the table. <laughs> Just for a loop. Are you sure about that bid, US? Just wondering. Uh, wait, can I change it? Yes, yes. I can see how an error could be made. <laughs> <laughs> Sam oh, to make game. Sure. <laughs> oh, one second. <laughs> I Maybe I should take my my bid. No, 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 no. It's not he probably missed a no. decimal point or something. Nothing is a very specific Nothing's, reason. Why. Nothing's actually changing with the with the. It's just it was an accident. Okay. Yeah, I can see that. Numbers only, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Decipher my shapes. <laughs> yeah. The. Yeah, that's better. Okay, the winner is China. No! Surprise! Surprise! Ah. And there are no zero bids. Oh. Everybody kind of went for it on that Ruel, one. Ruel, you are okay. I, I am. I'm honestly not that happy with. Uh... <laughs> You're a lean, mean machine. Okay, uh, let me put this on my little card here. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh! Ooh, oh. That's interesting. Gosh, that's uh, weird, man. Yeah, that is interesting because. Knowing that that's your is that your second one, Ruel? That is my second uh tile, okay. correct. So okay, so it's interesting. Yeah. You can kind of sort of gauge how much people are spending. Yep. It's a very powerful tile though. I yeah. mean that was a, a little mini game changer there, you know. I don't know. That was a, yeah. that was a big deal. The it's crazy thing here. is we can gauge we can gauge what they have, but we can't always gauge what they've spent. Exactly, yeah. right. exactly. That's exactly the, that's the that's the I can, right there. I can only put it up against what I spent and know right. that it was more than <laughs> that. Right. So, all right. We ready for the next round or next turn? I should say. Next turn. Yes. Yes. All yes. right. Cool. So, uh, this is a Japanese housing company. Yeah. Ooh, Another four, four points. Wow. Oh boy. Oh my lord of the board. Uh, <laughs> well done. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bad joke every time. Like my, my friends, my friends say it all the time, so I, I they it. just got me onto it. <clears throat> oh, I want to start using it. I'm going to start using it, Sam. If you don't mind. Right. Oh, Lord of the Board. <laughs> Subtle plug. Yeah. Totally. <laughs> all right. If you guys want this, it's going to cost you more than thirty-seven thousand dollars. Woo! Oh no! Gosh. Why do you do this to me, Jake? Don't like that. Uh, for the glory of Japan. <laughs> uh, gosh. I don't uh, like that. I feel like it's really sad that you got that one, you being Japan, because you likely won't win it, you know? Yeah, yeah. that's true. That is a little bit of a sad I'm, I'm not saying that you, you, know, you won't, but I'm just saying. So here's the thing. I don't want Jake to win this, but... At the same time, I don't want to pay that much money. No, I feel like my decisions are colored by the fact that you don't want Jake to benefit from them. <laughs> that might be it yeah. too. You know, you know what it is? I've just lost too many games of Twilight Imperium to you, Jake. And it's oh. it's, it's affected oh. my overall uh, gaming strategy. Twilight Imperium is a different kind of treachery right there. Yeah. <laughs> one, one of those 14 hour treacheries as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, oh my God. <clears throat> really? Am I going to do this?
Okay. I'm stressed out. I know. I, <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, when I emailed you guys, I should have said, Hey, you want to come over Saturday and get stressed out? <laughs> <laughs> you really should have. We're not mentally prepared. Okay. All right. Let me All look right, at Ruel's right. bid. Oh my lord of the board. Okay. <laughs> On. Uh, the winner uh, is the European Union. Oh. Additionally, the United States oh, no. bid zero dollars. Congratulations, okay. United States. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> that might have been a little painful. I'm sure it was. <laughs> we'll find out in the half hour. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, Nicely done. So take back your bids. Make sure to count them on your personal tile or your personal note card because you won that bid. Yes. And then, uh, Ruel, when you're ready, you can start the next auction. Oh my word! Hey, okay. uh, let me clear my board so, here. So get so don't so this is the second to last round already. Well, yeah, we're halfway through the game. You could look at it that way, but yes. Oh my gosh! Yeah, we're yeah okay. Yeah, uh, we only the been on sixteen one. tiles. The U.S. Uh, manufacturing three points. Mm. Mm, okay. Who's the U.S.? Sam's the U.S. Yeah, Sam is. God. Hey, Sam already used the zero. <laughs> oh, well, no, it's a new round, isn't it? This is a new round. Yeah. This is a new round. I I snuck my zero in right at the last minute there. Yeah, that was okay. good. Good timing. Uh, but, go thank, you, thank you very much. Three point tile though. Three points is good, right? Uh, it's not a four. I'm not sweating. <laughs> <laughs> Fours are all that matters. Come on, let's be real here. Okay, let's do. Um, Don't do anything you'll regret. I'm totally regretting this bid. Uh, I'm already regretting mine. <laughs> <It's> already <laughs> regretting <laughs> I'm regretting well, like I know he won't go higher than this one. <laughs> no. Okay, here we go. Thirty-five oh nine eight. Wow. Oh come on, man. Uh, good good price for that. I think that, that's a bargain, folks. That is kind of a bargain, but what we, I mean? know, we know it's not sticking around that amount. No oh way. Gosh. That's what you would say before you bid. <laughs> hey. Oh, Lord of the board. Jake, we know it's going for a lot more. Jake, don't you? Don't you? Don't. 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 <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Okay. Locked in. I'm thinking really hard about this one. <laughs> <laughs> That's a warning. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, please. <laughs> the winner is the US. Yes! Oh, oh wow. How much did you oh, bid oh. over there? Oh, that was, oh man. So don't forget to write right. that on your card. And game this is changer. Your wow. It might not actually be Sam, a game changer. I'm just freaking out. I'm just, I'm, I'm freaking out to make you guys feel uncomfortable. Sam, how many tells do you have? Three? I got three tiles now. We are we are making wow. our way. Just to wow. recap, we're halfway through. We've bid on eight tiles. And before Sam won that, we each had won two. So we were actually, I mean, we don't have equal points because some people have way more points than others. Uh, but we at least have bought the same amount of companies. True. Yeah. 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 You guys are all crushing me on the points, actually. Oh, <laughs> oh, there goes that, uh, the silver. I'm telling silver you, I, I've learned oh, many times. If, if it's silver time to stay <laughs> a <fan>. take out. <laughs> <laughs> European Union housing two pointer. Huh. Okay. Points. Two points. Hmm. Okay, we know who wants this one. I wonder if I care uh, about that. Let's we see. do know exactly who wants this one. Yeah. I wonder who that is. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Um, who is starting? Is it Sam? Forty thousand. Forty forty thousand. Forty thousand. Oh my god. I want you to have it. He really wants to keep it, I think. Trying to win back his bid. Yeah. That's a good. Ooh. That's a Don't even worry about it, guys. Don't even sweat it. Just give it to me. I really wants that one. Oh, because, uh, okay. You know? Okay. <clears throat> Actually, go on. <laughs> <laughs> You're all locked in. <laughs> Uh, yes. I've changed my bid like four times now. <laughs> um, and I feel like every time I change it, it really wouldn't make a difference if I bid that. <laughs> so, what are the chances of somebody landing right in between these two numbers? That right? is exactly what I'm worried about. A hundred dollar difference. No. <laughs> okay, we're going to go with this. I really hope. 
Good. All right, let's see. Ooh, some interesting things going on. Ooh, okay. So Japan has won the bid. Oh my god! Um, but we've got a zero coming from China. All right, Mr. Ruo. Wow. Yes. Well played, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Uh, maybe. Maybe. That was shocking. hopefully. Okay. Hopefully, so well there. <laughs> Hard to tell right now. Yeah. Uh, uh, Jake, you can take your housing of you. the European Union over there. Yeah. Oh, I, I, like, I like that you like to keep it very, um, you know, separated and uh, different over there. <laughs> well, the thing yeah. is, I want to be able to display not only the country it's from, but the type it is. And there's yeah. no easy way to overlap or splay them, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're comboing nicely over there. I also there. have bought the least worthwhile companies. You guys have all have like a three pointer. I have a twos and ones. But you have two uh, housing. So that's all yeah, right. Yeah, we'll Something. see. Yeah, it's true. Um okay. So <laughs> let's see. That was Sam's bid. Therefore oh, it is money. Okay. okay, here we go. We have a US two pointer fi financial. Hmm. Interesting. US two points. Financial. Hmm. I'm going to pull out that zero. You know, hmm. we, oh gosh, I don't want to win it too high either. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's another thing I love. Just that whole, like, I don't want to win this tile, but I don't want to make it too cheap. By right spending there. that much. Yeah. Like, yeah. that's what yeah. happens in the later half is like, well, uh, I'll put this amount to, you know, to jack it up. And then suddenly you win it. Uh, Oh. Yeah, it's like oops. We're gonna go <laughs> with a very safe twenty thousand five hundred. Yeah. That is a safe. Yeah, that's nice. Yes. That's nice. Well, nice and safe. Very, so very it, safe. You have plenty of room. Yeah, I like sure. that. Sure. I like that. <clears throat> plenty of room. Plenty of room. Oh my gosh! Oh, in Japan. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's smart. No, you you you've gleaned no information. It's just yeah. I mean you've shared no information, but like okay, good, good. <laughs> it could mean anything that little smirked laugh. I don't like any of this. I don't I don't trust any of you guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, this is great. Okay. Okay. Moment of truth. Let's oh, moment out. of truth. Trust. It goes to the US. Yeah, come on. How you are going to be so in debt? You say, are going to ah, be so in debt. Oh my god! Don't even worry, worry about it. Man. Don't even How worry about that? it. No zero bids. That's crazy. <laughs> one, two, yeah, right. That was an interesting one. Oh, that's so interesting. Okay, <laughs> I'm the auctioneer now. <laughs> this is the European Union four point. Uh, what is that? Manufacturing, manufacturing company. Ooh. European uh, Union four point manufacturing company. Um, that's a four pointer. Oh, geez, I gotta spend more money. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Maybe How much have I spent so far? Oh my gosh, that number doesn't look good. Sorry. Are you all tallying your total as you go? I'm. I'm doing it in my brain real quick. Yeah. You know, some mini math, but oh, it's, okay. it's 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 I, bad. I I'll figure it, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a bad area to be in right now mentally. <laughs> so the psychological saying. factor of certain numbers, like blank ninety nine, or like is the middle of the thirties like tempting for them? Is it not? Right. It's like, oh, no. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna go with. We're gonna go forty nine, forty five thousand nine hundred. Oh, whoops. I thought you already put a bid out. For some reason, I made up a number in my head that you put <laughs> yeah, You're welcome to do that. But, and I was ready to uh, put down for that. So I have to switch my entire uh, strategy. I don't know what just happened there. Wow, <laughs> dude. 45,900. A lot of cash. I need points, you guys. That's a lot of money. Yeah, well, maybe I've made a critical error. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wow, now it's getting, oh, the numbers in my head are risky. Hmm, okay. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep, yep. All right. I'm Here we so go. Curious. Final answer. 
<laughs> Ooh. <laughs> this isn't easy. Um. Okay. Well, the European Union has won this bid, okay. surprisingly. Uh, wow. The US has <laughs> bid zero. This is your first time bidding zero in this round, right, though? Yes. Okay. And then, uh, great, Ruel didn't win either. Ruel, did you bid zero in this round already? I did. So just a very small point of order of, like, do it in round three, because you didn't do it at all in round two, did you? Or did you correct. do it in both? Uh, correct. I did not do it in – I just did it this round because I missed it the previous round. I don't think it really matters what space you put it in then. Never gotcha. Mind. I did just get to use point of order, though, on my weekend, which is always like a <laughs> – <laughs> uh, All right. Well done, Monique. Thank you. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, is yeah. it well done when you're gathering debt, though? I mean, yeah. Right. Who can nobody. say? I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a nice, it's a nice uh, tile. We are in the total. final, final round, though. So, Ruel, go ahead and share your uh, company. Japan manufacturing two points. Yeah. Interesting. Hmm. This. Yeah. This one. Sucks. <laughs> I feel that. I feel yeah. that, that that suckery. Yeah, I felt that to the core. Yeah. Well. I'm going to keep it nice and friendly. Nice and friendly. Let's see what your definition of friendly <laughs> is. <Ruel. laughs> the last round. Ruel. Come on, throw a wild card. Yeah. Well, this is, I'm going to keep it friendly. You know, because okay. I know okay. We, okay. Okay. we got some money out there. Here we go. 23,976. Okay. That's a good bargain for that card right now, friends. I mean, I know you say bargain. I say, <laughs> not bargain. Um, there's a lot of things going on in the economy right now, Ruel. And uh, oh yeah, you're you are correct. Any number is not good. <sighs> what have we gotten ourselves into, dude? I'm uh, sorry. It's it's crazy how like simultaneously we're all saying we're having a great time and we're freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> it's true it is true that it's an it's it's all anticipation it's like yeah. a lot of anticipation it's all self-doubt is what yeah. it is. <laughs> anticipation and insecurity and also i've never had like numbers look wrong <laughs> principally <laughs> or aesthetically it's like this number won't work they won't buy that <laughs> <laughs> okay i'm almost there i'm almost That's there boring. Okay, let's take a look at this. And the winner is Japan. Yeah, baby. <laughs> and uh, we do have a zero bid from the European Union. Yeah. I had a feeling I had a Here feeling. Here we are. I know that bid was a little too fast. Monique, <laughs> you went out real fast there. <laughs> I, I, did. I did. I had a feeling. Hope we so, didn't give it up for too cheap now. <clears throat> I don't know. You, you... That is part of the worry. Yeah. That's always right. the worry. It's always the worry. I mean, that's just the stress of this game. Really? No, I didn't consider this game stressful until we started playing it again. <laughs> okay, guys, this is a, this is a three agricultural, um, and this is for Japan. Huh. Um, three agricultural Japan, friends. Three <laughs> agricultural <laughs> Japan. Okay, so. <clears throat> mm. Wow. Mm. Jake has four. I know. See? I'm looking at these. That they're gosh, well, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> now you know. Now you know. <laughs> right, we have to work together here, remember. Monique, it's even worse over like a 10 hour game of Twilight Imperium. It's like oh, I slow bet. death. You know? <laughs> Fifty-five thousand. Must be torture. <laughs> what? What? Fifty oh my gosh. Okay. That's a good deal. With how little we've been spending this whole game, come on, God, five thousand for a for a three pointer agricultural. Yeah, this is gonna get people. I mean, if you let him get it, he's gonna be the one who scores the most points. That's true. Most. Yeah, that is true. But I really it want works. It works either way. Whoever gets this, it's nice. Just make sure you're not getting it for too much more than what I put out. Right. Right. Okay. Um, hmm. But we definitely can't have you know Jake get this right. That's that's what I'm worried about. I say that a lot when I play games with Jake. 
That's fair. Okay. Uh, there's my bid. Here is my solid bid. You know, Ruel, I <laughs> bet I could sell t-shirts that just say, don't let Jake, and then an ellipsis after it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let me jump hmm. like 10 of those. Jake has won the bid. Japan. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, and then, uh, trust me, I'm freaking out too. Um, <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Jake's the only one laughing. <laughs> yeah, everyone else is crying. We've got a zero bid. Sorry, that came out with way late. Uh, China did yep. a zero. Um, my good job, Ruel. Uh, yeah, Jake to spend well, well played, a sir. ridiculous amount of money in the yeah. last couple rounds. Yes. It's the only way. I'm kind of hoping I've saved myself, but I don't know. Maybe you like, might have. In that. Yeah, I feel like that last tile might. Because I'm trying to go higher. Holy cow! <laughs> my dream tile. <laughs> okay, so it's not a dream. I don't. I don't even need it. Make Sam pay. It's no, this is a four point U.S. agricultural tile. Mm -mm. No, ah, I, don't, I don't even I really want. I like it. that last bit. I don't even want. It. <laughs> <laughs> it's a crappy company. Their CEO it's, is a jerk. Yeah, right? it's not. It's not worth it. Hmm. <laughs> okay. We're gonna go. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna go with fifty-five thousand one hundred and twenty. Hmm. Tacked on that 20. Bro, I think I, I feel there. like you need another tile. I do. But y'all y'all aren't making it. Mean, this is so close to the end of the game. I don't know so if there's, I can, yeah. there's one more tile. There's one more tile. You have one more chance. Okay. I'm not sure what I'm going to do either. This is tough. <laughs> Jake has a lot of tiles. <laughs> well, I guess he only has one more than me, but I, I feel like it looks like a lot more. Yeah. I mean, another agricultural would be nice too. Because you start chain. I shouldn't talk. You know, it's okay. okay. I, no, get yeah, I, get That's right. I get what you're saying. I get it. Um, <sighs> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't. <laughs> Guys. Woo. What do we do? Um. Okay, so. <clears throat> it is it is fun being the auctioneer yeah, <laughs> yeah. I like yeah. The auctioneer. no getting the information yeah <laughs> okay the winning bid is china okay but Ooh, you needed that unfortunately for china we also have two zeros <gasps> <the table. laughs> wait you bid a zero again sam Oh, you well, had another round. round to do. Yes, yes. I didn't realize you hadn't done it this round already. Okay. <laughs> nicely done. I don't know. It might not be that light. Nicely done. I think I'm making a lot of mistakes. This is true. <laughs> I'm hoping I did the least. That's kind of my only thing going for me at the moment. Yes, there is. Okay, yeah, we should remind ourselves that the, whoever bids the least gets a bonus six points, which is a yeah. lot. That's, that's I'm, not, a lot. I'm not there. Uh, yeah. I definitely am not. I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm going to not be able to. I don't know. I'm not going to speak anymore. I think I'm. I think I'm done for. <laughs> Goodbye, All right. USA. Last bid. European Union Agricultural Company. It's a one, come on, it's a one. And it's a one pointer. Interesting. All right. All right. Had to be the oh, last. This bid. is going to be such an easy one for you guys to get. But what do I bid in case I get stomped by you? <laughs> um let's see hey we should all agree to whatever he bids not bid more than and make him have <laughs> it that way we can force him into not being able to score yeah but then I, what if I a low bid out and you guys have to like go back on your agreement right that's what i'm yeah. saying yeah no agreements are binding that's right. <laughs> How about that? A soft agreement, though, friends? Okay. Uh, we can like that. I'll, I'll soft agree to that. Yeah, okay, so we're all soft agreeing. To Everything could change. Lower. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a non agreement <laughs> for the sake of drama. Um, oh, man. This is a tough number. Um, we're going to go. Well, 
I mean, Ruel will get it because he's only got three. T- oh, yeah, I guess Monique could too. Monique too, though. They haven't been as much as Ruel you. versus yeah. him. Ruel. I kind of need to jack it up a little bit because honestly, even if you guys let me lose, it doesn't mean you're going to guarantee you're going to beat Sam. Because if I right. beat, if I lose the because of the bid, Sam will crush you on points. So you need to stay in it. Um, we're going to go. <laughs> <laughs> we have 17 17 reasonable amount of money interesting. Huh. okay interesting thank you hmm. okay oh my gosh why did i i, I should have bought more tiles earlier i totally regret I shouldn't have soft agreed yeah no soft <laughs> shouldn't have soft agreed <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was good. Oh my uh, gosh. Let's see. This matters a lot. It uh, does. Uh, uh, uh ooh. Ooh. So is it uh, accurate that none of you guys have your zero bids left? Or is yes, the, that is accurate. That is correct. Information and yeah, we can see they do not. That's okay. The- okay. Okay. Now they could always just bid a dollar. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Totally, totally. But what's the fun in that? Oh my gosh, that's right. Uh, what is the uh, 17? <laughs> 17, 8, crucially. 17, 8. I might have hosed myself by bidding this low, but like, I don't think I have. I think you guys need to get, grab the card. Yeah, that's a good, you know, that's a good opener. Whoops. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I didn't see a thing. <laughs> All right, I'm going to start looking at these. <gasps> <gasps> are we saved jake are we saved oh i don't know we're gonna find out right after this because the european union has won. Oh, oh. I want it. oh no oh, I mean, she's got one of each so, soft. oh no go ahead and go on to your scoreboard first off and just let's go top to bottom and let's kind of do it somewhat together even though we won't be looking at each other's boards because we'll keep some suspense so first off put in your company vp which is all the tiles value of the tiles that you've acquired just by themselves so i have what are you just are we just type type in a number yeah just type it in i have nine for instance i i also have nine. oh yeah well we shouldn't tell uh, <laughs> okay um, all right and after you've done that your zero bid should be automatic because that we've already mm-hmm. done that right cool, cool then nationalization for every company that below oh, air and script everybody good yeah uh, yep okay cool um every company that belongs to your con- uh country go ahead and add in a check mark so if you have you get it uh there's a bunch of scripting errors weird yeah mine's not adjusting now Oh yeah, I'll just manually do it. Yeah. Um. So that's okay. Yeah, it's just not. It's not automatically updating on mine. Yeah, me too. Function chunk attempt to perform arithmetic and string value. I have no idea what that means. Uh, yeah, you guys can just manually do it. Yeah, the text fields are still working. Okay. It might also be because of how you have things overlapping on your board. I truly don't know. Um. Regardless, everybody cool with their companies nationalization. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. Then monopolization. So fill in the check marks for each of the type that you have. And this is a time to reveal your um, industry tile as well. Okay. Because that automatically fills in one of those spots. Wait, it doesn't do it for you though, right? It looks like it does. Oh, no, it doesn't do it. It doesn't check the box for you. Okay. So I will check my boxes. Oh, guys, this is not good. And then it's time to add in on your note card. Um, And then also the... Oh, okay. So total spent. So I would like do another line break and then write total and then add your total in. Yeah, so the grand total has a little space to put. So I'm going to put that in there. Wait, what? Oh, it does? Oh, yeah, even on there. Yeah, I meant on your note card. But yeah, that works too. Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, that works. Oh man, me and my funky biz. Now I gotta write down or I gotta bust out the calculator. Yeah, that's true. That's what I'm doing. That's what you get, Ruel. That's that is exactly what I get. Darn it. Zero. Okay, plus. I'm out of my debt. Oh boy. Oh, that's funny. It turned out to be wrong, anyways. Really hope. um... 
I didn't bid too high. <laughs> oh man, I bid way too high. Uh, I think we can double do check your math real quick just to make sure. That's what I'm doing. I'm just double double checking it. Ooh. I'll also double check. Ooh. There's <laughs> a bunch of numbers going on. <laughs> oh, no. oh shit, I'm, I miscalculated. I'm gonna just calculate this. Calculate. Okay. I'm double checked. I'm good to go. Yeah. I'm, and I'm, I'm also well. double checked. Okay. Um, yep. This one. Mm. I'm very curious. I am too. <sighs> oh my gosh. I was excited. Thousand dollars. Okay. To hear everybody's totals. Cool. All right. Uh, do you want to write your total in your scoreboard? I have done yes. so. I have done so. All right. Jeez. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll go first. I spent one hundred and seventy-four thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Wow! Phew! Oh, no. That's it. <laughs> uh, Ruel, you spent one hundred and twenty-nine thousand. That's correct. Monique, what? Is <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. That's I spent one hundred and thirty-one thousand. Oh my gosh! Okay, so Monique, you were removed from the game. Oh, oh, oh. she spent well, that much. Barely. Oh. Like that two thousand got six points. Uh, oh, I did get six. Yeah, so you get yes. to add the six here. No, I dude, she definitely would have won if that hadn't have happened though. That, I can't believe it. All those US and one of each industry, you're at like 35 points. Oh my god. I gosh. know, I just I miscalculated that that spending spending oh, that last card, huh? The so, last card. Ruel, if you oh, there's no place to add the six, is there? Um I think yeah, you, okay, can, there. you can oh, it's doing it automatically. Yeah, you just did it. Oh, you just oh. check it. Okay, so you got 32, I got 35, and oh, damn. Dude. I only got 27. 27. Oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> how? <laughs> uh, what a crazy game. What a bananas game because you had the exact yeah. same amount of points, Monique, didn't you? Didn't you also yeah. have 35 before that? 35. Yeah. So what's our difference? We have a maybe a 10,000 wow. point difference. It was that last bid. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. it was that last bid. What was your last bid? Can I ask you? Yeah, what was the last bid, Monique? 30,000? So if you hit L on your note card, you can unlock it and bring it out to the table. We can kind of see what everybody bid. There was a there was a couple of very interesting bids out there. Yes. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Not wow. Wow. Not, not good. <laughs> oh my gosh. That what last crazy, card, like, sixty-five thousand. Yeah, that was an wow. interesting one to see. <laughs> yeah. I was panicking at the end there. I needed I needed tiles. Um, that last bid monique you you did 30 was it i did okay so i wouldn't have because my first bid i think was like 29.99 so i would have lost to you anyways should have let take oh my gosh but once again to review the totals you had 183,000 spent uh i had 174 i had 29 you had 131 131 and that's still very very close i was so close uh, I shouldn't like I, I, and I like I mean the fact that that's ten thousand off and yeah. Yeah. At the same point yeah. that's that's just one bid difference you know yeah. right. and me and me and Ruel are about ten thousand off yeah uh, I thought I thought you would spend a ton of money Sam but then I guess I, I was early in the game right my, yeah I was earlier in the game and I was thinking maybe it would be wiser to do that earlier but I I don't know it was really close it was yeah almost worked but it didn't work good enough. One thing yeah. that you do, Stan, that's pretty cool is like you kind of take an aggressive stance early on, and then that forces us all to like not play defensively, but play like aggressively cautious. I don't know how to defend to define this. <laughs> right. Well, I was trying to hope to like make you guys think that I was just spending so much money that way you guys could take risks. Yeah. And then yeah. those it risks worked. could actually it be worked. more than my risks, hopefully. That definitely but, worked. Because it, it, what was my like, total spent? spent? What was that? Your total spent? My total spent was one hundred thirty-one thousand and three. Yeah, that's but, so shocking. That is like I—I I thought you were close to like two hundred grand, honestly. And yeah. I, was, I figured, oh, okay, I, I'm at one twenty or so. I'm like, okay, I got a good shot at this. But oh, that was close, man. I had a couple yeah. wins in there that were just right over. 
just oh, really? right over. Yeah. It was just like, wow, that was so cliche. There was one that I was so, there was just a hundred more. I think it was, I was like, oh my oh. gosh, how <laughs> those ones are really good. Those ones feel good. I know you guys, I know another one of you did it when I was the auctioneer. So yeah. One of uh, one of the interesting aspects of this game is when you play with five players, there's a fifth industry type called government. Additionally, there is a tile that everybody gets where once per game, they can flip it to look at any one person's bid they choose. Yeah. Oh. So oh. you get a chance to get a little more information when you're not the auctioneer. Once like if someone game. bids you and you're like, how yeah. did they beat me? I bid so much. I want to know what they bid. You can be like, well, I'm going to use my one time shot to look at Ruel did. Oh, he bid a billion. What a crazy <laughs> <laughs> so I did not use one of my zero bids, so that's two points. I'm still a point short. Jake, did you use how many zero bids? I did missed you? a zero bid as well. I think in the third round. Okay. Yeah, me too. But so I, like Ruel, like Sam, if he had gotten just two thousand less, or like maybe three thousand less, he would have got those six points, right? So would that have brought you into the win, Sam? I yeah. was at 27. It would have been so close. He, so it would have been 33. 33. Yeah, it would have been 33. Wow. I still wouldn't have won. I still wouldn't have won. It was close, though. Oh, man. man. Oh, Jake. Jake. Yeah, I think we've all three. learned to listen to Ruel, I guess, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now you all know. <laughs> you now Back have shirt that says we should have let Jake three. just says, I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> we should have all been watching. Yes. Uh, you, you all know you've experienced the um, losing to Jake. Oh, my gosh. I've, I've done it so many times. <laughs> But it's so much fun. In the club. Yeah, uh, Nightcat the club. asks, can you use that one time thing after bids are locked in? Yes, it's actually after uh, the winner has been announced, I believe, of the auction. So you can't do it if it's in the middle of the still of bidding because then you could just bid over them, which mm -hmm. is dastardly. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. This was a lot of fun. And I 100% want to play this again this year with you four. Yes. Maybe even a fifth as well. Absolutely. Yeah. Awesome. I. Nice. Love this game. I, I think it's so good. And again, Jake, just like you, the first time I ever played it, it's like, oh, instant love is just, it's so good. It's it's stupid good. Like, it's <laughs> a game that I, I, I will be talking to people about this game and trying to explain it, and they'll just be like, okay, that sounds fun. I'm like, no, you don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just say that. You have to, you have to acknowledge this. Yeah. Um, before we go uh, all three of you are amazing content creators i'd love to give each of you an opportunity to share what you do and where to find you so ruel since uh we started with you let's also start with you now tell us a little bit about where we can find you what you're doing cool thanks jake um again i want to thank you for having us on jake this has been awesome as always uh friends you can find me at ruel gaviola all over the interwebs um, i'm on twitter instagram facebook all the things. I also run a Twitch channel where I play games almost every day um, with friends and or family, uh, usually at 7 p.m. Pacific. Um, also, a very, uh, a very grateful to be on the boards for the American Tabletop Awards and um, Tabletop Writers Guild. So you can find me there. Go to those. Uh, go to my uh, website, RuelGaviola.com, find more info. Um, I do podcasts as well, and I just like to stay busy and stay out of trouble. So, that's <laughs> <it>. <laughs> I love it when you stay out wow. of trouble. Wow! <laughs> uh, excellent, uh, Sam. Let's go with you. All right. Um, you know, I do a lot of different things, but you can just find me at Lord of the Board. Uh, mostly YouTube, though. Um, I usually have a focus on like strategic board game content. So, couple to couple of strategy guides for some awesome games. Roots the best one. So that's where I started. Um, but I'm branching off into more games. Um, I'm also on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Just started a TikTok. I've got everything. Lord of the Board. You can find me. Um, yeah, I'd love to have you. Yeah, awesome. And Monique. Yes, thank you. Thank you also for having me. Yeah. Uh, but I primarily run a YouTube channel with my husband called Before You Play. So it's youtube.com slash before you play. And over there, we do full two-player playthroughs of typically like heavier Euro strategy games, but we have a wide variety of stuff over there. So it's a uh, full two-player playthroughs and reviews. And uh, you can also find us on Instagram where we post pictures as well as on Twitter. But on Twitter, I am before you play underscore because we didn't, somebody else took that originally. Hey, I am huge fans of you too. So oh, you guys likewise. all really go out and just support they're so Thank cool you. 
Yeah, and Jake, you're cool too. You're pretty cool too. Yeah. I, I, you know, first time meeting you, but wow, you know what a cool guy. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> well, I'm always excited to meet new people, especially new awesome people like you guys. So thank you so much for being here. Um, before I plug Good Time Society, I'll mention that QE is now actually available. It's at boardgametables.com. You can also follow Board Game Tables at Board Game Tables. They they got their name first, so there's no underscore there. Good for them. Oh, Ruel's got oh, it. Oh wow. Yeah. Is that the is that the cover that you weren't as much of a fan of, Sam? That is the one. <laughs> I, just, sense. I, I just think it looks unpleasing. I don't, it just doesn't look pleasing to me. I don't know. Okay. What do you need? Like a, a European farmer standing there holding something like a big bundle of cash. Okay. I think, yes. I think that they should have taken the, the four colors that they have for each industry and just had like a split of the four industries and like have them like do some kind of graphic design. Yeah. piece. I don't know. Yeah. Make it look, look a little bit more graphic and less like, an outdated monopoly, you know? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's just me, but I, the game is great. So yeah. I don't even care. I mean, at the end of the day, I definitely want to get it. So yeah, I encourage people to pick it up. I'm also going to try and find a copy. As Ruel said, after we played it, we're always just like, I want to play more. You know? yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah, we totally, totally will. will. Um, but thank you everybody who joined and watched us today. We are good time society. My name's Jake. I run this company with my good friend, Becca Scott, and we make board game and some video game and just general nerdery content. Uh, you can find us at the YouTube, which is uh, youtube.com slash good time society. We're also going to be streaming stuff on Twitch tomorrow. In fact, on Sunday, we're going to be having a game of Alice is missing, which is a completely text message based RPG. Uh, it's super fun where you try to find out what happened to your dear friend Alice, but you can only communicate over text. Um, that's uh, going to be a blast, and that's on here tomorrow at Twitch TV slash Good Time Society. Uh, additionally, you can check out our podcast to boldly watch, where we watch Star Trek: The Next Generation and talk about how both awesome and silly it can be. Uh, we're really enjoying that. We're on our end of our second season, so come follow us there. Um, I have a bunch of other plug things to plug, but just follow at Good Time Society because that's where you can find all of our information. Come join our Discord as well. I think that's going to be it for today. Uh, thank you so much for joining us, everyone who came and watched. And we will be back Saturday for yet another version of Gameplayed. Bye, friends. See you later. Bye.